Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna and today I'm going to be bringing to you a review on the Karma Shower Jelly. Now this shower jelly, as far as I know from the research that I've done online, the last time that this was done was for the Kitchen Exclusive range uh, for 2017 and this is the one that I have here. Um, so this was back when Lush used to do um, kitchen as in like separate products from the uk whereas nowadays they have a kitchen subscription box format where you're sort of locked into um, the five or so products that they pick per box whereas back when they used to do the traditional kitchen you could sort of pick and choose which ones you wanted to order um, and they used to do it pretty much every week it was kind of like a weekly thing that they used to concoct all these um, beautiful little treats out of the uk um, manufacturing plant and you used to be able to buy them on there now this was a little bit before my time I never got to experience the kitchen in that way unfortunately but it does seem like a fun concept and kind of sad that they don't have that concept anymore but there it is there's a the little karma shelly shower jelly it is the 100 gram size so it is the smaller size uh shower jelly so the ingredients for this product are glycerine fresh lemongrass infusion chamomile infusion sodium laurel sulfate, propylene glycol, carrageenan extract, perfume, alimi oil, lavender oil, pine oil, lemongrass oil, patchouli oil, orange oil, and some other little bits and pieces. So the Karma shower jelly. For those of you who are looking at this going, what is Karma? How does this work? What is going on? So let me break it down for you. The Karma scent family is a very classic scent family at Lush Cosmetics. It's been in their range for a very, very long time, if not towards the beginning of it. Once again, I don't go back that far, so I can't really tell you, but I can tell you that this is a very classic Lush scent family, and it is one of the scent families that they are really, really known for, and it's the one that people tend to rem remember the most from Lush. So the Karma scent is basically easiest way to describe it. Just think of hippies from the 60s, 70s, that sort of era. It is that sort of scent that you, you would imagine a hippie to smell like. It is very earthy. It's definitely got that sort of patchouli side to it. There is pine oil in these usually. Yes, I did say pine oil. Very good. Um, so the pine and the patchouli gives it that sort of really earthy side to it and makes it sort of have that sort of naturistic kind of smell to it, um, almost like a primal scent, if that makes sense in a really strange way. Um, and it, it is also characterized by having that big punch of orange in there so yes it's got the regular orange oil i have seen sweet wild orange oil in these i've seen brazilian orange just depends on the product i think they just do whatever they like really it does often have lemongrass in here as well but i don't notice the lemongrass as much as i notice the pine and the patchouli and the orange and then there's some other little bits and pieces like the lavender and the alimi which once again i don't really notice that side to it as much just focus on the pine the patchouli and the orange and that's sort of what you're going to get from it so you can probably guess it is quite a earthy scent like i was saying with that citrus hit and with a sweetness to it as well that fruity sort of sweetness as well so it's such a beautiful scent it's almost like um yeah just sort of stepping into a buddhist temple or something like that it's sort of how i would imagine the incense at a buddhist temple to smell like or some sort of um, spiritual place you know that sort of scent that you get when you go to spiritual places um, that are sort of like eastern spiritual places if that makes sense I hope I'm not being disrespectful or anything I'm just trying to explain it the best way I know how but um, looking at this shower gel there is or shower jelly should I say there is definitely a little bit of dryness on the top um, just because it has been sitting for such a long time since 2017 so it's almost four years old now that I'm reviewing it but the texture of it definitely was fantastic it wasn't too dry wasn't anything like that and the scent is still exactly the same as it probably would have been back then it's still quite a strong scent punchy scent um, and beautiful so for those of you who might not be familiar with the shower jellies once again I am just going to explain it very quickly sorry if you uh, a bit more of an advanced slushy, but I want everyone to sort of understand what the product's all about. Um, like I was saying just then when I said shower gel, it does remind me, it's basically 
a shower gel and a soap in one. If you can think of that sort of concept of having the shower gel and the lightness and that sort of feeling um, with the lather, but the consistency of having a soap um, to rub on yourself as well, if that makes sense. That's the best way I can describe a shower jelly to you. Um, and you would use it in a similar way to a soap, but it does have that nice leather like a shower gel would as well. And that ease of use like a shower gel does as well. So yeah, it is a great multi-use product. I used to think it was a bit of a sham. You know, in the beginning, I was kind of like, oh, shower jelly, really? But I actually really love them now. So if you're someone like me who's sort of on the fence about trying a shower jelly, I definitely definitely recommend that you do. There are a couple in Lush's all year round range at the moment, not Karma, unfortunately, but there are some other ones in their range. So overall thoughts, as you can probably tell, I really, really love this product. It did lather up really nicely. Um, the scent just lingered and was really, really beautiful. And I really enjoyed that aspect of the product as well. No complaints about it. Definitely a five out of five product. Highly, highly recommend purchasing this. If you do see it for sale, um, you know, I might get into a bidding war with you on eBay if you are buying it off eBay. Uh, but yeah, definitely recommend it. It is a really beautiful product. Um, and yeah, if you like those sorts of earthy scents with that nice sweetness as well, you will definitely really enjoy this one. Um, and it is very true to scent in terms of other Karma products that I've tried, such as the perfume. Um, very, very true to that scent. So if you are a long time Karma lover, uh, or someone who is obsessed with the Karma Scent family, you won't be disappointed. Very similar to the soap as well. So yeah, very much the same sort of scent that you are going to get from that. So thank you so much for watching this video. I sincerely appreciate all the support I get on this channel. Please stay tuned for more Lush reviews like this. And until next time, take care, and I hope to see you again real soon. Bye for now.